And would the children like to come forward, please? Oh, hi, Wiley. Is that your cousin Charlotte? Awesome. So, have any of you seen our church rabbit? No. No? Yeah. Yeah, some of you have, yeah. <laughs> we, okay, so the church rabbit is kind of a weird phrase you don't hear every day. But there's a, a bunny that hangs out. There's a big rock um, kind of by the trees just south of the church here. And there's a bunny uh, rabbit that hangs out there. It must be because the rock's warm, like the sun warms the rock, because it like is smushed up close to the rock. And, um, and yeah, the bunny just hangs out there and has been for like, not every day, but most days. And it was definitely in the fall that it started because it was brown when it started and it's white now. So it's been there for a while. So it's a real live bunny. It, it must live in the bushes in the park there. And uh, it just comes and hangs out at our church every once in a while, just kind of beside our church. So this bunny has been here and I thought, well, should I chase away the bunny back into the bushes? Uh, but I thought, well, bunny's not really doing any harm. So the bunny comes and it goes. But I noticed one day that someone left some carrots for the bunny underneath the, the ramp, the little uh, wheelchair ramp at the side there. And then those carrots disappeared. And then another day someone said, oh, well, I brought some beet greens for the bunny. And they left the beet greens right by where the bunny sits and the bunny ate the beet greens. Well, not in front of us, but next day, no beet greens. So I was like, hmm. So the people around the church who are here lots and see the bunny, even though no one asked them to, they, they fed the bunny. They, they gave a present to the bunny. Even though the bunny is perfectly capable of going and getting, like bunnies live in the wild, right? Yeah, they can eat bark off trees and stuff like that. They can live, but, but people have been giving gifts to our bunny. And you know, that's what people are like. For the most part, people like to give presents to each other. They like, they like to give gifts to each other. And so that's one of the reasons we do that at Christmas time. I mean, we do that because Jesus was a gift to us, and so we want to give gifts to other people. But we also do it because it's fun to give gifts. And the Bible says that God made us kind of like God. Uh, it says that God made us in God's image, which is... It's, I guess if you're looking into a mirror, we're kind of the mirror image of God. We're like God. And God gives us so many gifts. God gives us our bodies. God gives us the world. God gives us families and friends. So many things. And so we're like God. We want to give things to other people. So we give gifts to other people. And uh, it's, it's fun to give gifts. So one of the things that we're going to do later today is we're going to um, go downstairs, and the youth group too, you're gonna come with us and we're gonna uh, wrap some gifts for other people. Um, so if you wanna come downstairs later, you can pick out a gift for maybe someone in your family or a friend or someone special to you, and you can wrap that gift up and uh, you can give it to them. Well, you can decide whether, want to, want, whether or not you wanna give it on December 24th, or even today, maybe, or Christmas Day. You could, you could, or even you could wait till after Christmas if you don't see someone. Anyhow, we'll give gifts like that. <laughs> 